Hello guys, today I want to show you my newest SQL generator. I have made many different ones in the past, but each time I make something unique to them. And this SQL generator is used for creating items to World of Warcraft private servers. So, as an example, we can make a head, shoulder, chest legs and gloves and you see that uh, the inputs for name and display ID uh, appears when you choose what type of item you want to make and we can choose to make cloth and uh, we need display IDs and if you don't know them already you can just search for whatever you want here you can search for any name you want but I'm gonna search for a helmet and if you don't find any helmet that you like here you can simply just uh, erase the last character and add an another one uh, so you can do it multiple times until you find something that you like so mm, yeah let's go with this one so you can simply just click on the display ID here and then you can search for a display ID for shoulder and you click display ID and you search for chest and then you click display ID here and then you choose uh, leg guards okay this one do doesn't want to appear on the tooltip for some reason doesn't matter I'm gonna go with these ones and last but not least you can do gloves so let's use these ones and then you can just cancel that or click outside the box so let's write in a name like testing head shoulder Chest, legs, gloves. Required level 255. Quality epic. Binds when picked up. Description uh, nothing. You can choose classes if you want. If you want it to be for specific classes, you can make it for like only warrior, paladin, and death knight. Um, in this case I'm not going to use for specific races so I will ignore that it will be selected for all races if I ignore it so let's choose strength stamina and attack power you can type in 3500 here and you can ignore the rest and here you can write spell, ID, spell IDs if you want, or you can just ignore it. Uh, I don't know which spells I would add, so I just ignore it for now. And then you click on insert item. And then you will see here that five items has been inserted. And you have the, the list of display IDs here, or uh, entry IDs here. So you can then search for uh, for these items in your database uh, so you can write here for example select all from item template where entry is greater than or equal to this entry ID oops there I missed testing so we can simply just fix that before we reload the server uh, testing done okay so now we can uh, go in game and we can try the items but we can just have a look here and we can see the stats and everything so everything has been added okay and you see allowable class here it added 35 for um, 
for the classes that I choose. So it should be correct. We can log in on my uh, Hunter and we can add reload dot reload item template and then we can do add so you may have noticed that you didn't need to choose uh, an enter ID it will automatically uh, increment the uh, entry for you so yeah here you can see I cannot use it on this character but you have the items here and they are working mm -hmm. so I guess that's it for now bye bye